Well, two former Stockton police officers have been indicted on charges of assault for allegedly beating a teenage boy. Crime reporter Henry Lee is live in the newsroom with the tales on this story. Henry. Well, Andre, it's still fairly rare for officers to be charged with assault. It's the people they come across who are accused of resisting arrest. But in this case, two officers were fired and indicted. Take your Seat belt Body camera video shows Stockton police officers struggling with 17-year-old Devin Carter at the end of a high-speed chase. I'm not resisting. I'm not resisting. Yeah, you are. Yeah. Give him your hand. Give him your hand. Carter says officers kicked and punched him for no reason back in December. He ended up with black eyes, back injuries, and a broken spirit. Now, former Stockton officers Michael Stiles and Omar Villapadua have been indicted on felony assault charges. Both were fired for using excessive force. Those who violate their oath to protect and serve, discredit the good work that law enforcement strives to do every day. San Joaquin County That's DA right. Tory Verber Salazar says two other officers in the case were not indicted. This indictment reminds all of us that when police use unlawful force, they undermine community trust. Four out of four should be prosecuted. Carter says he's still afraid of being pulled over in the future. I am in fear for my life. Say I do get pulled over by those two officers the way I will be treated next time. If I get pulled over, will there be retaliation? It's not going to heal the wounds that Devin has suffered and the lifelong um, trauma that's going to come. However, you know, it's a step in the right process. Attorney John Burris is suing the department. These officers are like renegades. And that they, it was four of them, and I refer to them as a pack of wolves. All of them did charge, but they were like feasting on Devin, each seeking to get their own pound of flesh. Now, San Joaquin County DA says because of this case, her office will now review body worn cameras for those accused of resisting arrest or attacking officers. Andre. All right, Henry Lee reporting for us live in the newsroom on the story. Henry, thank you.